So today I'm going to show you how I built the base of my um, wine cellar and I kind of go through each of the steps so you can kind of see what was involved. So enjoy! So here's a picture of the room before and we used blue masking tape to kind of help us visualize how big the base of the piece would be. And then we bought materials and here you can see them blocking Sean's office. Really helpful. So the next step was demo and we used the oscillating tool to make sure the cuts of the baseboard were clean and we kind of just ripped those out um, because as you'll see in a minute um, everything fits pretty tightly wall to wall. So we used two by fours to build the base here and then we'll in a minute we'll show you that we put a three quarter inch plywood top on. We used three quarter inch plywood for everything because it's so strong and we knew that the wine was going to be very heavy. Um, and so we wanted to make sure it was as strong as possible. So the next step was to build the drawers um, that will go in the middle. And I used my Craig jig to make sure the pocket holes were perfect and everything came together perfectly. This is my first time building drawers and I think it went pretty successfully. Everything ended up pretty, pretty much square. So there's a finished one. And then in a minute, you'll see the idea with the wine crate actually in the drawer. So the next step is to kind of put the walls on, the, the side, side supports and the back support on. Um, and we screwed the back support into the um, studs of the wall actually to make sure that it was super sturdy and then just pocket hold the sides on to make sure that everything was square. So here's kind of a mock-up of what I was hoping that it would kind of turn out like. And the next step was to put on the slow close drawer slides. They are so fantastic. I used another Craig jig um, to make sure everything stayed level and it made installation so easy. Um, I always hear kind of horror stories of putting the drawers in and it was not that bad. So we started with the right side first, got everything um, fit perfectly and then put in the left side you'll see in a second. And then the next step was just to put the top on. So we put the top on and it's a three quarter inch plywood sheet again. And you'll see there's a wine fridge there now. <laughs> Originally that was not in the plans, um, but somehow I mismeasured or something and it was a little off. Measurements were a little off and the wine fridge just happened to fit perfectly. Happy little accident. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.